Welcome to 111 Royal Oak in the city of Enam Hills. And this house is located in Peralta Hills, a very exclusive area of Peralta Hills. Uh, it's listed for 2.96 million and it's 5,500 square feet. And the good thing is this house is over an acre. Fifty five hundred square feet. Let's go in. Okay, come on in. Let's go inside and check out this house. All right, as you can see in the entry, it leads to the grand staircase. And upstairs, there's a master bedroom and three other bedrooms, which we will visit in a minute. But first, I wanted you to see the living room and the dining area that will lead us to the remodeled kitchen. So come on down. So you are viewing the living room and the dining area. Very spacious, very peaceful. And there we are gonna enter the kitchen. So as you can see, or as we are about to see, the kitchen, the sellers have spent a lot of time in the kitchen fixing it up. These are all marble countertops. And as you can, if you can come along, I wanted to show you the stainless steel sinks. And what they've really done is installed the Viking oven with a Viking microwave over there. So this is the Viking microwave. The cabinets are custom. We have a Viking exhaust fan. And of course, the stainless steel sink and faucets. Also the flooring is matching flooring, matching colors with tiles. And the kitchen leads right into the family area over there. By the way, I'm Mike Patel. I work in Anaheim Hills with First Team Real Estate and Christie's International Real Estate. And I want to thank you for watching so far. Keep watching. And I would also like you to subscribe to my channel because I come up with videos like these with updates, lifestyle, statistics about Anaheim Hills in Orange County every week on Thursday. So please subscribe. I also want to acknowledge Thomas Tran with Advanced Realty. He was kind enough to let me tour this home and expose it to you and everybody else. So thank you, Thomas. If you have any questions, please either contact Thomas or myself. and We'll be glad to answer any questions about the home. So let's continue with the tour. So as we come out of the kitchen and the family area, this here is very unique in this house, in this huge custom home. This is what we call the entertainment hall or the entertainer's hall. As you can see, it is huge. It's very large. You can make this into, you can make into a pool room, a yoga room, a theater room. You have a lot of options. By the way, I'm sure you realize that this house is vacant. So use your imagination, how you want to decorate it, how you want to color it. The house does need a little bit of updating. So it is priced accordingly. It's listed for 2.96. You could use some upgrades, choose your colors, choose your upgrading. Maybe you want to change the flooring, but use your imagination and you can do a lot of things in this entertainment hall, including all the other homes. This hallway leads us outside in the front towards the Peralta Park. Also, they have a custom wet bar. As you can see, the sellers used to entertain a lot. So he has this custom uh, wet bar as well. One of the cool features about this house is that it has a huge driveway starting with this gated entry. The driveway is huge. It's landscaped with uh, 
uh, custom stones. And as you can see, it's a long, long driveway which leads up right into the front entry and into the garage over there. They've also spent a lot of time on the landscaping. I wanted to point out that as you come through the gate, you can park in the three car garage here and go upstairs, or you can drive up there and park it near the tennis courts and go into the house. So that's a cool feature to have, especially when you're coming late at night and if you want to park outside or just outside the garage. Okay, so in case you park over here from the long driveway, you can come up here as I'm coming up here. As you can see, if I come up here, we saw the entertainer's hall earlier. So this leads to that entertainment hall. So this is actually the second entry to the house, which is a great feature. The other thing I like about this house uh, is this outside patio. It's, it's enclosed, it's got some ceiling fans, it's got some lights, and it takes us to the front entry that we talked about earlier. Okay, let's visit upstairs. As we go upstairs, there are three bedrooms and the master, so let's visit those. Here is one of the bedrooms. I won't go into much detail. You can see how bright and spacious it is. Of course, we need bathrooms upstairs. And I'm not sure if I mentioned earlier, but this house has six bedrooms and six baths altogether. Okay, here's another bedroom and a bathroom combined. You can see that it's very spacious, very light and bright, and it has a view of the tennis courts and also outside. Okay, we're up here in the master bedroom. If there's one place you want to spend in this house, it's in this master bedroom. As you can see, it's pretty large, very spacious, and it leads to the huge master bathroom. I'm really excited about this master bathroom. It is huge. As you can see, there's a double sinks with custom counters, lots of lights, and to the left here, there's a jacuzzi and a bathtub. Right next to it is a separate shower, glass shower enclosures and faucets. And obviously custom flooring, marble flooring. Mm -hmm. There's also a steam bath, which is right there. So you, you can enjoy when you wanna relax. Okay, one of the great thing about this house is this outdoor deck. This deck is right off the master bathroom we just saw. As you can see, it's a huge patio, patio and a deck, and it has a panoramic view. One of the cool things about this view here is Peralta Hills Park is right there. And every July 4th, there's fireworks show. Obviously, next year we may not have one because of COVID, but you can see the fireworks show from right here uh, on July 4th. It's a very exclusive area to see from. The deck continues. And I wanted to show you the yard where I talked earlier. See how huge it is. You can see the whole acreage here. Okay, as you can see, we're outside now and we're actually in on the tennis court. As I mentioned earlier, these are all acre lots. A lot of homes have tennis courts or basketball courts or huge pool areas or play areas. This family enjoys tennis. If I have time, I'll play tennis as well. But I wanted to point out that all these homes are spacious. You can do a lot of things with it. If you're not into sports, a lot of people are converting these to entertainment areas, party areas, uh, huge decks, huge pools. So a lot of options you have. The other thing I wanted to point out in case I did not, is if you can see there's solo panels over there. There's actually 35 solo panels and they actually all paid off. So the solo panels goes with the house and you probably have pretty much minimum 
uh, electric expenses. So anyway, I appreciate you watching so far. Uh, hopefully you subscribed. If not, this is a good time to do it. Again, this is Mike Patel with First Team and Christie's International Real Estate. Thank you so much.